a century. From the time I was born, watching cartoons and watching animated violence that would make me laugh or watching things like Three Stooges slap each other. Not realizing that I was promoting the same stuff that would cause me to go to jail. I shake my head on this whole thing about how programmed I, as well as so many millions in this world, have taken in our favorite shows, our favorite music, things that just move us, causing us to do things. I think about how I wanted to be a basketball player. What caused me to do that? Watching basketball. What caused me to want to make it in the music industry? Seeing other people make it in the music industry. What caused me to want to be a commercial artist or advertising designer or fashion illustrator? Seeing how much money you can make off just drawing. Foods I eat. Why do I like the foods that I eat so much? It's because I was programmed to like that. And the beat goes on and on and on. What caused me to like a certain kind of female? Was it the programming? It has something to do with it. But not all of it. See, I have to deprogram. And let Yahweh God the Father reprogram me. Because right now, I've got too much junk in my system. That has caused me to think the way a lot of people do. I think to this lady in Kentucky. Who who is probably programmed. But when you give somebody the right and the freedom to religion while you on the other hand have the freedom of speech some things cancel out other things sometimes you're going to come to a point where you have to agree to disagree but when did the freedom of religion cause you to be in prison and when did the right to love somebody else cause you so much grief and so much pain who made us gods I'm quite sure it wasn't Kenneth Copeland but I digress see I have to get these programs out of my system I have to come to the Lord like a little child not dumb no, 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 no. Not ignorant, no. Innocent. Wanting to know him. Wanting to know the way, the truth, and the life. I have to deprogram. I have to shut down. And I have to reboot. Because if I don't, I'm going to attach myself to everybody else's beliefs I'm going to be the clone I'm going to remain a slave instead of walking free of Christ how do I do that? I can't do this within my flesh because you know the spirit is willing but the flesh is weak so I have to deprogram And as I go through this, I'm going to go through some pains. I'm going to go through some heartaches. I'm going to go through some thoughts of loneliness. But in the end, I will be free. So, what will you do? Will you deprogram? To be reprogrammed? 
much fun for them. Peace be with you.